Francisco, welcome to another educational lesson. I'd like to welcome all you guys. If you're new here, welcome. If not, welcome back. We'll get right into it. It's going to be a quick one. Most of you are familiar with this building. Most of you are not familiar with what's inside this building. This is the Dome of the Rock. The only thing inside this building is a rock. Most of you are familiar with this building. Most of you are not familiar with what's inside this building. This is the Dome of the Rock. The only thing inside this building. So this is the Dome of the Rock. This is um in the, in the this is. <clears throat> what the Muslims have in their city building is a rock a rock that has come to me that is exactly a copy of the western United States as you can see by the end of this video I know right that has come to me that is exactly a copy of the Western United States. As you can see, by the end of this video, I know right now you're thinking, that's crazy, that's ridiculous. But by the end of this video, you're going to be able to see absolutely that not only does it look like it, shape like it, the topography on it is even exactly the same. So stick with me here as I go through some different maps and show you exactly what you're looking at. So this is not the whole United States. This is just the Western, what we consider the Western Hemisphere. And if you look here, this shows how much of this portion of the land is being bought up by the government. And as you can see, most of the land that's being bought is on the Western part which fits the map on the in that part of the world this is the map show so that map that we seen in in the promised land in, in the dome of the rock the people there are taught that the that that is a map of the promised land the most holiest place on in the world and then when you cross-reference that map that map fits the uh, West Hem Western Hemisphere of the United States when you did the uh, BLM US government federal so the, government has purchased up 90% Bureau of, of Land and Management which you know has managed their systems into the, the ground don't cover this is a, a uh, map showing you the ownership federal, state, local. The dark green on the left shows you that all the forests in the western United States are owned by the federal government through the Bureau of Land Management. We've all heard about the, the ranchers having battles, losing their farms and ranches, being taken. And there's a reason why they're being taken. And there's a reason why the map that rock in the dome is a copy and exact match of the Western United States. Islam believes that that rock represents the holiest place in the world. So they call this the holiest place in the world. Why do you think the Europeans say, this is the promised land. This is God's country. This is God's country. This is the promised land. When we came, we came as pilgrims. What do pilgrims do? They go on pilgrimages. <laughs> this map shows you that uh, this is God's red and yellow areas are areas you will not be living. This is from Agenda 21 with the United Nations. Here's a transparent overlay showing you the states as they line up to this map that are included. It 
there's a topography map one of two that I'm going to show you in many instances this is an exact match and here very shortly I'm going to show you how exact it really is now why is this what is this it's because I believe that the United States is being prepared to be split in two pieces maybe three but two I believe at the moment one is going to be given to the going to be given to Islam to the Muslims. I remember the um, the treaty of peace and friendship with the with the Muslims Oops. that's the piece you're looking at the Western United States that has been purchased up by the federal government is being prepared to be handed over the eastern United States will be given to the Zionists they will have control on this map here you can see the arrows pointing to the spots of topography on the right hand side you'll see the three hour arrows that are pointing to what looks like an eye the top arrow the lower arrow is pointing to what looks like nostrils the lower arrow is pointing to what looks like a mouth and you can see on the rock all that topography exists and on the topo map of the United States all that all that exists it is an exact match and even looks like a face yeah it does and then you have a face in the upper left hand corner as well so yeah I'll show you so this is a face see the face see the nose see the eyes you see the mouth with the little shading over here and uh, this is a face so this is the hair this is the forehead this is the eyes this is the ears this is the nose little pointy ass nose and you got the, his mouth is open his fat ass chin look like a witch look like a witch chin that's a witch it's like a demon right here it comes down this this is neck his head supposed to be right here. His body's supposed to be right here. This the back of his head. You see that? The back of his head. This is crazy ass ears. I understand this is uh, somewhat mind blowing, but this has been shown to me. And then the face up here changes too. Now it's a face looking this way. See the eyes, the nose, the mouth, like it's smiling. And it's got like a body with his hand on his temple. See his arm on his temple. We can do this all day, you know. I struggled for a long time trying to figure out why I seen, or why it appeared that Islam was being demonized, but yet at the same time we have Muslims that have infiltrated our system including Barack Hussein Obama along with many other Muslims including the governor of South Carolina Nikki Haley Nikki Haley is not her name just Google Nikki Haley's real name and it's because we have factions two different factions at least the Zionists and the Muslims that or you might say Islam uh, now you notice all of these Islamic nations migrating their people out of their countries mostly men and into these into European countries and eventually into America which many have already arrived have a working agreement you might say to split the United States at least into two parts the eastern United States going to the Zionists as you know most of your Zionists uh, come out of Israel and Israel or excuse me the Zionists not the average Jew but the Zionist Jew and there are Zionist Christians and whatever they want to call themselves but they're going to have the eastern United States and the promised land 
is the United States. It's not Israel. The promised land is the United States. It's not Israel. The promised land that they, that the 12 tribes of Israel were promised, they believe is the United States. And that they, that the 12 tribes of Israel were promised, they believe is the United States. And this rock in the Dome of the Rock matching it exactly the western United States is a lock there's a lot more to be said about this guys um, I need any of these effort that, or knowledge that you have that once you've seen this information and you want to share it to me share it with me please do uh, this is huge information and I hope you can see it this further explains why the spear upon the top of the World Trade Center, the One World Trade Center, is identical to these spears that are above, or what they call minarets, above all your different Muslim, Islamic. We have to unite <clears throat> temples. It is by design, it is intentional. And therefore you see if you have eyes. Now if you consider yourself a Muslim or Islam is your religion and you're listening to this, it's not intended to offend you. It's not this video is not intended to offend anyone. It's intended to educate us, the little people, as to what the elite's plan is long term. Again, please take a moment and click share down below and post this on Facebook, Twitter. Send an email to all your friends. There's nothing in this video that is offensive, but it is something that everybody... Now, I know what you're thinking. You say, oh, how could this be? I don't think so. This is crap. <clears throat> this is just propaganda being pushed out. <laughs> Who this guy look like? Huh? Who that guy look like to you? Huh? I bet you I put my face to the side. I have the same type of turban hat looking afro he got. Huh? I bet you we got the same facial structure. The same beard. And this, this is found in America. Researched by the the university in Ohio. These artifacts have been authenticated as as true artifacts. Yet no one wants to give them any credit because how could the Hebrews, the full-bearded African American, Afro Mexican, Afro Puerto Rican, Afro bearded people? be in America they are from Africa no ladies and gentlemen America is the promised land these Caucasians keep telling you every day this is the promised land this is God's country but you never believe it look at this ancient map with all these earthworks these mounds that's that's aligned with the celestial like Orion's belt and all of these different things because you are astrologers, you are navigators, you understood the sky. You were builders, you built temples, you built mounds. Come on now, this is you. Yeah, they're trying to you're gonna say, no that video is propaganda. And look at look at the stuff they're trying to push in your face. And you don't even know. Watch this trailer of this movie we're about to watch. But look at this. This is writings from Christopher Columbus that's being held in the, the in the library in Seville that was written to Queen Isabella talking about capturing 
of the promised land in the new world, America. Talking about <clears throat> this is the beginning of the book or collections of authoritative sayings, opinions, and prophecies concerning the need to recover the holy city and Mount Zion and the discovery and conversion. You're gonna say, no, nah, they're just talking crap. They said and the discovery and conversion of the islands islands of the indies and all the peoples of the nations huh islands of the indies her ferdinand and isabella are spanish ruler now you're gonna say okay they just told us up there that north america is the is um is the promised land let's see where they want to where they're saying mount zion is and where i can prove Mount Zion is in this region. All right, let's get into it. Now, this is a this you can look this up. This is a Biblioteca Colombina in Seville. Okay, you can look it all up. It's in the the prophecies. El libro de las profecias, the book of prophecies. All right, check it out. Bolivia, Peru. So they saying South America in this movie is where they're looking for the lost city of Z. Hold on, hold on. Where it mess me up. Ba -ba -bum. To dream, to seek the unknown, to look for what is beautiful is its own reward. A man's reach should exceed his grasp. Or what's a heaven for? You are the explorer? Give me a hand. I wish to find a lost city. Find a lost city. To find a lost city. I wish to find a lost city. What you seek is far greater. Seek is, is far greater than you ever imagined. It is your destiny. It is I not know you your return. destiny. hidden civilization where one was considered impossible to exist we may well write a whole new chapter in history i 